while going through yesterday's edition of the popular daily devotional book titled Our Daily Manor by Dr. Chris Ikwokbov. A certain prayer point concerning a popular blogger surfaced for those that missed that edition, see the write-up by Dr. Kwokbov below, pray concerning the fellows who took me to court years ago in connection with a program we had at the stadium. This lady claims she was injured in the crowd. The case has been on and I received lots of text messages from one Linda, a blogger, Facebook specialist asking me to drop a certain amount of money otherwise they would work with different journalists around the world against this vision. Scatter any plan to publish any lie against this ministry. Three people have dropped dead because of this in their camp. Shockingly enough, it appears our dear Linda the blogger also read the same book or might have seen the write-up. In her usual nature, possibly in an attempt to convince or confuse her readers, she chose to write a letter today, stating the following, I'm not a fraudster, wouldn't know how to defraud someone even if I tried. I'm not a blackmailer, never blackmailed anyone in my life, never will. I don't have the liver to do such, plus I was raised better than that. Don't know how anyone can stoop that low. I don't collect money from people to take down stories from my blog. That's like using my own hand to ruin myself. People can use it against you later, with evidence Seth. Seriously, I would be foolish to do that. Any blogger would be foolish to do that. Don't do it. You either take down the story out of compassion or you don't. Putting on our FBI hat here, we simply ask one question why did the blogger choose to refute Dr. Kwokbov's write up today? Quite suspicious since she could have written her letter two days ago.